This guy can keep a pace inside the octagon that is literally a shocking thing to behold. His opponent is in deep trouble if he comes into this fight out of shape. back in the octagon. Bruce Lee makes his way out of the tunnel, and he looks very prepared for tonight's fight. This guy has some of the best arm bars and leg locks we have ever seen inside the octagon. The technique and the speed of his execution are second to none. Bruce Lee set to fight Napalm. Our tail of the tape. For this welterweight fight, Lee is 13 years his elder. Napalm is six inches taller. Lee will have a one-inch reach advantage. Once again, here's the veteran voice of the octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC welterweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a karate fighter. Making his professional debut here tonight, he stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of Richmond, Virginia, Cruz. And now he's losing to both fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 162 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Cruz. The Dragon Lee! And with the attributes, our referee in charge of Herb Dean. Herb Dean, our referee for this welterweight matchup. Here tonight in Los Angeles, California. Fight scheduled for three five-minute rounds. White trunks for Napalm. Black trunks for Lee. Napalm's much taller than his opponent tonight. How can he use that to be successful in tonight's fight? Keeping his opponent at the end of his strikes and making sure that his head is out of distance of return strikes. He hit him with the hook. Swinging early, both men. Didn't quite connect. Big kick lands. Powerful left hand. Turning into an all-out slugfest. Left hand counter. And a big leg kick. Man, he goes down. Light on his feet. They clinch early. Strong elbow in the clinch by Cruz. Big hook. He delivers another hook. Knee to the body. Inside leg kick. Joe, we're seeing some nice work. He's really staying busy. Good punch. There oh, it is. look at that. Oh, solid jab. Oh, and another one. That hurt him. Oh, beautiful hook. Defense, and he counters with a straight. He slips the punch. Wow, what a back and forth exchange. Just over three now. Oh, he lands the roundhouse to the body. Lee with a nice hook to the body. And a good jab. His defense tonight's excellent. Man, outstanding takedown defense tonight. Oh, nice inside leg kick. He lands a clean combination. They 
they split. Head kick. Nicely done. Oh, huge kick to the midsection. He did a nice job blocking the head kick. Wham! The right and the left behind it. The right hook misses. The huge head kick is blocked. Two minutes remain in the round. Nice shot. Nate Palm with the inside leg kick. And he is fixing it up nicely. Great work inside the clinch. Excellent dirty boxing. And they break free. Switching his stance up a little bit. Cruz with the straight to the body. Beautiful inside leg kick. Nate Palm gets caught with the left. Not even close. Good block, and he delivers the straight counter. Man, Joey showcased some great takedown defense tonight. He has stuffed a ton of attempts. Delivered that right to the midsection of his opponent. That hook is blocked. Big left hand. Good exchange back and forth here. Nice punch by Cruz. And he's looking for that left. He's doing a great job of being unpredictable and mixing things up here. Left, right. Now he's got the Muay Thai plum. And separate. And he lands the roundhouse. That's wow. a hard uppercut. Oh, huge suplex. What a brilliant pass. Right into Mount. Excellent job. Ten seconds left in round one. Good inside leg kick. Oh. Round one in the books. Great performance by both fighters in that round, Joe. This is turning into a very intriguing matchup. Let's take another look at some of the actions from that round. And here's a nice shot lands perfectly.